Hey everyone, I'm Baby Lion. Okay, I am currently in Varanasi. I have been sick this past week. I got sick from dal makhani. I don't even know if that's possible, but I was sick from dal makhani. There has been a lot of buzz and fuss around ChatGTP and AI. Before coming here, I have consulted AI. Varanasi is one of the most interesting cities I have been to in my life and there is so much to it. It's very, very prominent in the Hindu religion and so I have chosen of the many, many, many interesting things, five things that I will be doing this week, okay? So first two is guts. So it's very, there's 84 guts in Varanasi. I will be going to firstly um, an evening Ganges ritual at the, okay, I have notes on my phone because I'm trying to improve my pronunciation, but this city is not making it easy. Okay, so firstly, the Dash Hash Vameth, um, known for evening um, uh, Asti rituals. have been dropped off close by and I'm heading to the Dashva Mahet Ghat where the ritual is shortly starting. Um, I think this is a good illustration of how busy this place is and how many people are heading there. So at night the river is fully illuminated by um, by lights. It's really beautiful, and um, I just this wall is just really, really, really cool. Let me try and get through here to show you. Oh, the ritual has started off. Ah, oh, the ritual done. The river has started. A bit late. So crazy. So I've paid 200 rupees to get the following view and um, I do think it's worth it. It is just absolutely crazy that and this is every single day like this ritual has is held every single day. Over there you see the river Ganges. The lighting is absolutely beautiful but you can see all of the boats so they have like hundreds of boats all lined up. Okay, so a bit more on the ritual. So it's a spiritual and a religious ritual. It's basically giving praise and what the, the, the one of the major things about the river and just the significance of, of Varanasi is the fact that it brings salvation and you know the the water is known for washing away your sins. The this guy is known as one of the busiest in Varanasi and um, is known to be the spot where Lord Braham sacrificed 10 horses. In front you see the um, priests performing the RT ritual. Tomorrow morning I'll be going to the Asi Ghat, which is known for the morning Asti ritual, which is, um, well, it's a, it's a, a Hindu ritual. Um, I will also be visiting the Manikarnika um, Ghat. I am not going to go into detail here. Um, you go consult ChatGTP on what, what, what is the significance of, of this Ghat. It is one of the top three most famous Ghats in, in Varanasi. Good morning! We are watching the morning Asi. Asti over the Asi Ghats. It is absolutely beautiful, the lighting over the river. A lot less people than in the evening. I was standing in front of a lot of people. <laughs> hey! 
beautiful ladies who are accompanying me. I will be going to the Kashi Vishwanath Temple. Okay, so this is also the, also the most important and probably in India um, temple in, in Hinduism, in the Hindu um, religion. So I'll be visiting here and just seeing, you know, what it's about. The original, which is located next to the Ganges River, is considered one of the holiest uh, temples in Hinduism and is visited by thousands, thousands, thousands of people um, every single day. Um, so people take um, a bath in the river and then they visit the temples. There's no filming inside of the temples, but a bit more on the replica, firstly, is um, it was a replica um, built in 1931 um, due to um, the original one being located right next to the Ganges River coming un under constant attack, so they built this replica. The original one um, is one of the most holiest or it, if not probably the holiest um, of temples in um, in India, in, in Hinduism rather. Okay, next <laughs> I know, wait for it, suspense, is I will be eating some of the most famous food in Varanasi. So there's lassi, chat and then um, kachori. Pan is also quite famous in, in Varanasi but I, will, I have been eating pan and in numerous places across India and I'm not a fan so I will not be trying pan in Varanasi okay but the other three I'll try I'm super excited I love Lassi hey everyone okay so we are busy with point number four I am going to have famous chat in Varanasi so um, there are two items there's the lassi oh no sorry three items there's the lassi and then there is the it's of the many three items there is lassi and then there's chat and then kachori now mr khan my auto driver took me to the hospital yesterday from my food poisoning and he recommended i not have kachori so i will not be having Kachori, I will only have chat and lassi, so I am going to follow his advice on this one. <laughs> okay, so I've made it to the first of the delicacies blue lassi. How long has the shop been here? 96 years old. 96 years old, wow. South Africa. <laughs> So the menus are quite funny, so there's the different flavors, but there's like five flavors, so then it's like coconut and mango, and then mango and coconut as <laughs> another one. <laughs> I found it quite funny, but I don't know if it's maybe just like if the one is coconut and mango that the base is coconut and then you have a mango flavoring or if it's mango and coconut then it's vice versa i'm not sure um, 96 years old I had chat in Delhi a few weeks ago and I was not a fan <laughs> but at the time I was also sick from food so I'm trying it again this looks super fresh like it looks like everything looks super fresh and really really looks nice um, okay so it finally is the Sarnath I'll be visiting there so this is um, 
what the significance or the importance of it it's in the buddhism religion so this is where um it is known that buddha had one of his first sermons so that is the <laughs> importance yeah okay so here we have the istupa so this is where buddha had his first lecture um as you can see i'm standing outside because it's still closed but definitely still getting a, a good view <laughs> The bottom part is original and then the top part is came after. So this is absolutely beautiful. So spinning these wheels is known to give good luck. Um this brings me to the end of this week. Varanasi has just been Oh, I'm definitely going to need some time to process all of that, but it's been amazing. I feel so lucky to have finally made it to this, like, I mean, it's like wool and the world, such a renowned place. So I, I just feel so lucky and I know that I'm going to be talking about this this week for, for many years to come. So from Anne Baby Lion, love you all. Bye.